Hello students, Michael Sanchez here with Danny. Hi. Danny, I want to ask you, what is your favorite part about the summer? So what have you been, mm -hmm. been enjoying so much, um, the most this summer? Camping. Camping? What do you like about camping? Um, I like just camping with my family, like hanging out and playing games and going places I've never been before, been to before and uh, Cool. Have you played your violin at all while camping? Yes. You have? I have. That's fun. <laughs> yeah. What were people saying? How fun and how much fun they were having listening to you play the violin? Uh, well, they weren't really around. Like This was okay. a couple summers ago when I did that. Okay, fun. I haven't done it this summer yet. <laughs> cool. All right, well, let's do our lesson. So let's have you do Old Black Joe for the audience out there. All right. And we're going to talk a little bit about vibrato today. So go ahead and uh, start just the first line for me. Very good. Got my bow here. All right, so like I mentioned earlier, I was noticing that when we were doing vibrato, we were kind of tensing up our right hand, right? So it's kind of like that thing we were doing, like doing two things at once, tapping the head and rubbing the tummy at the same time. Yeah. So we have to be able to do this, but not do anything different here, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So this stays the same even though we're shaking the hand. But I think what we were doing a little bit is kind of tensing up while we're, while we're doing that. <laughs> okay, and when we do that, it kind of causes kind of a stiffer sound. So here's an example. This is with me tensing the grip with vibrato. Hear that? Mm -hmm. So we need to keep this relaxed, just use the index, still do the vibrato, but what we want is to have that kind of free sound, loose sound, that we get by having this relax. So like this. Kind of more like that. Go ahead and try that for me. This is the first uh, couple measures. Beautiful. Much more freer sound. Thanks. So some things that could ten cause tension with doing vibrato would be tensing up the shoulder. That's a potential. Mm -hmm. Could be that your back fingers are kind of tensing up kind of like here, there. Yeah. Could be also just overall stiffness without bending your wrist, right? When we bow, we always want to bend the wrist. Use the index. Very good. So. Danny has a very good vibrato. It's just um, things we need to work on right with the right hand. So mm -hmm. nothing really needs to change here, but we actually need to work more here with when it comes to vibrato. Any questions? Mm -mm. Ready to do our next video? All right. Thank you so much for watching today's lesson, and hope you guys learned something today. Feel free to email me if you have any questions. RivertownViolin at Hotmail.com. Hope you guys have a good day.